There are two ways to give your students access to these digital Valentines. The first way is to have your students click on the Valentine that they want to customize. They'll make a copy and they'll start customizing their Valentine that way. Now, if your school district doesn't allow students to click on these outside links, no problem. What you'll do is you'll make a copy of each of the templates and then you'll assign them in Google Classroom or however you push out your links. When students get the view only copies, they'll go to file, make a copy. They'll type in the friend's name that they're going to send the Valentine to, and then they'll click okay. Here's an example of a completed Valentine. So students will use text. They'll insert images right from the insert image icon in the toolbar. They can change any of these headings that they'd like. Now, here's an example of another one of the templates. Students will type in the friend's name that they want to send it to. They can click and drag over these headings on the right hand side. I've included student instructions on this template, but I've also included video instructions for your students so they can watch the video from home and know exactly how to customize and how to send their Valentines. When students are finished customizing their slide, they'll just get rid of the sayings and the clip art on the edges here. They're gonna click the share button in the upper right hand corner and type in the friend's name at their school or their teacher that they want to send it to. They can choose for the person just to view it or comment on it. Students can include a message if they'd like, but they don't have to, and then they'll click send. Now, how will your students receive their Valentines? Well, they'll go into their Google Drive and they're gonna click on their shared with me folder. So you're gonna tell them to do this. Then they can click on any Valentines that they've been sent, read them. They can even comment on them if the person allowed them to comment.